What's going on you guys? What's up? What it do? Welcome back for another video. Crazy, this is the first video I'm putting up in the new year. It feels like New Year's Eve just like came and went, right? I hope you guys had an incredible one. I hope you were very safe and had a ton of fun celebrating with your friends and your family. Um, thank you so much for coming back to my channel if you've been with me for a while or if you're new. I'm also extremely grateful and appreciative to have you guys. I hope today's video can be an awesome resource for you to help you hit all of your goals in the new year and truly keep that momentum and that passion and that drive going throughout the rest of the year. Because I don't know about you guys, but I know myself, lots of people in my family, lots of my friends, everyone sets like super crazy goals for themselves in January, but it seems that a lot of the actual passion about those goals seems to fizz out within, you know, a few weeks. And we talked a lot in my last video. Um, if you haven't seen it yet, check that out. We talked all about setting goals and actually attaining them in the new year. And I gave you guys my best girl boss habits for success, things that I utilized a lot in 2017 to expand my mindset and learn a lot and also grow my business. So I feel that video is a great resource for you as well. If you're new and you just haven't like checked it out yet, um, be sure to do so because this is actually a continuation of that video. So in that last video, I told you guys that I made a vision board for myself for 2018. And this is something I've been doing for probably like four to five years. I personally think this is so beneficial and it is such a great resource for you. It's an awesome visual representation that you can look at every single day to stay motivated and stay pumped up about your goals. And then that will in turn push you to take the necessary steps of action every single day towards actually achieving those goals. So I did make myself a board for 2018. I wanted to share with you guys what I put on my board and why, kind of what priorities, like kind of how I prioritize each goal. I think there's definitely a specific like plan on how, like where you should put the words on your board, what colors you should do. I did mine very specifically and I put each piece in a certain place with an intention. And I think that's very important. So I wanted to share with you guys how I organized mine, kind of what the like science and mindset was behind it. So you guys can create one at home for yourself. If you guys do create one, be sure to tag me on social media. I would love to come check it out on Instagram or Twitter, just to check out what your goals are and help keep you accountable. And I'd love to follow you and comment and know that my video was a resource for you is so freaking cool. So yeah, if you're not already, uh, please go ahead and subscribe to this channel. I have tons of new success and girl boss type of videos coming out in the new year that I've been working on and I'm super excited to share with you guys. Also give this video a thumbs up and let's just go ahead and get into how I created my vision board. All right, so before we get started, we're just gonna go over what supplies you guys need. I just chose to use this two pack of styrofoam white boards. I also got the other one for my mom. Um, you can use any plastic or a board from the dollar store, a cardboard, whatever you have at home will work just fine. I wanted mine to be pretty big, so I picked those up. I also decided to use glue and scissors. I bought tape just in case, but the photos stuck down better when I personally used glue. And then I also got this marble adhesive paper here. It's just basically like sticky paper. I'll link it down below if you guys wanna purchase some for yourself. I think it turned out awesome. And you can also use this as like a backdrop or like you can stick it onto the wall if you have like a beauty room or an office, it looks really cool. You can use this like peel and stick paper for multiple things. And I know a lot of you have asked where I got it. So I'll have that listed down below for you guys. It's very affordable. So what I'm doing before we actually glue the pictures on is I wanted to make a really nice marble background. So I'm just basically mapping out how much I need and then I trimmed it. And you basically just wanna pull the paper from behind very, very slowly and kind of smooth everything out as you go so there's no bumps. Again, you can totally leave your board white in the back. You don't have to even do a background. I just thought this would look really cute. I also decided to add on a little bit of this silver glittery tape just to make my board like super extra because I thought it'd be really cute, but you don't have to do that. I just wanted to customize mine and I found this um, sticky tape at Lowe's. It was like $2. So once you have everything set up, we're going to head online. If you have magazines, where you want to cut out pictures that's fine but I didn't have any so I went online and what I'm doing is searching for exact pictures of things that I'm going to accomplish in 2018 this right here is a home that I want to buy so I actually took a screenshot of it and I put it on my desktop and we're going to print out that picture later then I went ahead over to Pinterest and I typed in girl boss and entrepreneur and success because one of my main goals is to really expand my business this year. So I'm pulling up a bunch of quotes right here that just resonate really well with me and that I feel go along with my business. So I'm just basically screenshotting a bunch of stuff and then we're going to print these out and we're going to put them on our board. So it's very, very important that you guys 
Print out pictures of exact things that you want. Like be extremely specific. That house that I printed out, that was actually a model home that I went and toured actually about a month ago. And that's the exact complex and the exact cabinet colors and floor colors. It's literally the exact home that I want. So the more specific you are, the easier it is for the universe or God or whatever higher power you believe in to bring you your exact goal. So if you want a new car, you want to search for the exact car that you want, the exact color, the exact tire color, the rim the windows, the seats. You want to be as specific as possible. If you want to make a million dollars this year, print out an exact picture that says that has a million dollars on it or say, I will make a million dollars this year or my business will expand to be a million dollar empire. So right here, I was just screenshotting tons of stuff about being a young entrepreneur and being a girl boss because one of my main goals this year is definitely to expand my business and launch my Boss Babe Academy. I also printed out a picture of the exact Mercedes SUV that I truly believe that I will attain. So I printed that out. Um, I chose to print out all my pictures in color just because I think it's more visually pleasing and I love having a board with like pink and yellow and colors that just make me happy. You want to just print out stuff that when you look at the board every single day, it makes you happy and it makes you motivated and driven to actually achieve those goals. So again, if you have magazines, feel free to cut stuff out that way. I just chose to do it online. I was just printing stuff out right here out of my color printer. This is actually the exact Mercedes SUV that I want to attain. So I printed out a bunch of pictures. Then I just kind of laid everything out on the floor since I had a lot of white excess on the paper We're just going to be cutting everything to fit and then we're going to go ahead and design how I want to put it on my board um, So I printed out a picture there of a Tony Robbins seminar That's something I've been wanting to attend for a really long time It's called date with destiny if you guys don't know Tony Robbins is the absolute best motivational speaker and guru and business coach He is incredible. He's one of my main inspirations. So I wanted to have him on there what I'm cutting right here is that exact model home that I went and toured that I truly believe I will attain. My lease is actually going to be up in about five months and I do not want to have to renew it. My goal is to have enough money saved to go ahead and purchase that home all by myself. So I printed out multiple pictures of the living room and of like the main entrance walkway. So when I look at this vision board every single day, I know what I'm working hard for. And like by you just continually looking at these images, it plants that image in your mind and it just by you you know, seeing these images reoccurring every single day just keeps me so much more motivated to actually attain my goals. I also have a picture of my son in the middle, as you guys can see. I truly believe that whatever is your top priority, you need to have in the middle of your board. I want to make sure that nothing ever comes above Christian, that my relationship with him just gets so much more strengthened in 2018 and I keep being a mom and keeping being his best friend as my number one priority even though I'm so excited about like business stuff and things I'm working on I never want to forget that Christian has to come first and that he's my best friend so I put him right there in the middle I recommend whatever's the most important thing in your life put that right in the middle so you can remember what you're working hard for and like why I'm working hard and expanding my business and saving money is all so I can provide for Christian so I always want to make sure that he's in the middle. Uh, what I did there is basically just laid out where I wanted each picture to go, and then I centered everything around it. So I put Christian in the middle and then just kind of centered all the other things around him, basically. So I really like how it turned out. Um, this was kind of my final product here. I added a few more things on after the video, but this was the gist of it. And these are just my major big goals that I truly believe I'm going to accomplish in 2018. So yeah, I really hope that you guys enjoyed that. Please go ahead and tag me in your own vision board pictures on social media. I would love to come over to your page and see how creative you got and kind of how everyone arranges their stuff differently really intrigues me. So I would love to see your creation. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I would absolutely love to have you subscribe down below here to my YouTube channel. Like I said, go ahead and follow me on Instagram because I'm making it an effort to put so much more stuff on my story every single day for you guys. And I would absolutely love to have you over there. I'm also going to link my last video about how to attain all of your goals in the new year. We expanded so much on expanding your income and your mindset and just having a more positive outlook on life and truly believing that you deserve a higher quality of life and taking those necessary steps to achieve all of your goals and achieve that better life for yourself and for your family. I've got really good feedback on that video and I'm just I'm really passionate about expanding it and like I want so many more of you guys to hear this information and we can all just chat in the comments and support each other. So I will also link that below. So Tons of things down below. Never forget to look in the description box. But I love you guys. I appreciate you. Have an incredible first week of January. I am wishing you nothing but success. I love you, and I will see you guys in my next video. Mwah.